Born 13 January 1969 Stephen Gordon Henry MB is a Scottish professional snooker player and a commentator for the BBC and ITV. One of the sport's most accomplished players, he became snooker's youngest world champion in 1990, age 21, and went on to win the World Snooker Championship seven times, surpassing the six world titles previously achieved by both Ray Ridden and Steve Davis. Henry held the modern era record for the most world titles outright for 23 years, until it was equaled by Ronnie O'Sullivan in 2022. In addition to his seven world titles, Hendry has won six Masters titles and five UK Championship titles for 18 Triple Crown tournament wins, a total surpassed only by O'Sullivan's 21. He won five consecutive Masters titles between 1989 and 1993, and five consecutive world. Titles between 1992 and 1996, both records in the modern era. One of three players to have won all three Triple Crown events in a single season, he is the only player to have achieved the feat twice, in the 1989-1990 and 1995-1996 seasons. His 36 ranking titles are second only to O'Sullivan's 39, and his nine seasons as world number one set a record under the annual ranking system used until 2010. A prolific break builder, Hendry has recorded 776 career century breaks. He was the first person to reach three officially recognized maximum breaks in professional competition and ended up with 11, surpassed only by O'Sullivan's 15 and John Higgins's 12. Awarded an MBE in 1994, Hendry was voted BBC Scotland Sport Personality of the Year in 1987 and 1996. In May 2012, after appearing in his 27th consecutive World Championship, he retired from professional snooker, ending his record 23 consecutive seasons in the top 16 of the world rankings. Hendry made his decision in response to a severe loss of form caused by the Yips, a condition that had first affected his game 12 years previously. In September 2020, citing improvements in his play, Hendry announced that he would come out of retirement and accept an invitational tour card for the next two seasons. After an almost nine-year absence from the tour, he returned to professional competition at the Gibraltar Open in March 2021. He competed in five other ranking events up to and including the 2021 UK Championship, but failed to advance beyond the round of 64 in any of them. In April 2022, his Invitational Tour card was renewed for a further two seasons. Hendry also competes on the World Seniors Tour. Hendry was born in South Queen's Ferry, West Lothian, brought up in Gorby, Edinburgh, and then Dalgetty Bay, Fife, where he attended in Vakithing High School. He later returned to Kirkliston, attending nearby Queen's Ferry High School from the age of 14, and lived in a flat in South Queen's Ferry during the early part of his professional career. He met his future wife Mandy Tart at a Pontins holiday camp when he was 16. The couple married in 1995 and settled in Octorada. They have two sons, Blaine, born 1996, and Carter, born 2004. In 2014, Hendry left his wife after 19 years of marriage and moved to England to pursue a relationship with 26-year-old children's entertainer and actress Lauren Thundo, whom he had met at a snooker event the previous year. Hendry has a single-figure golf handicap. He enjoys poker and has appeared in several televised tournaments. Hendry is also keenly interested in football, supporting Scottish side Hearts and English side Chelsea FC when returning to Scotland from the Euro Asia Masters Challenge in September 2003, Hendry had his queue broken when it was packed. As luggage on an international flight he was taking. The queue, which he had owned since he was age 14, having purchased it for 40, was the queue he had used when winning his seven world titles. Since the 11th of September 2001 attacks, snooker players have been required to put their cues in the holds of aeroplanes, where they are susceptible to damage. In August 2011, HM Revenue and Customs successfully applied to Glasgow Sheriff Court to liquidate the assets of Stephen Hendry Snooker Limited, the company set up to manage Hendry's sponsorships and promotion, following its failure to pay an 85,000 tax bill.